This is what I got. I will unbox everything and use it in the next few seconds. Guys, for today's work, I'm gonna need this roller and these tools. In order to use clay, and clay, obviously, this is from the brand Primo. It's uh, an Italian brand. It is uh, air dry clay, right? Spray filled with water. I think I need this because I don't have anything to put my clay on so it won't stick so I'm just going to use this yeah I've got this water in order to wet my sponge This is in order to cut your clay. And you cut like this. Here I started to draw uh, a random shape but you can uh, draw it before in a paper and then you put it on top of the clay and you trace it. Then I cut the edges using a cutter. And I added some water and uh, using a sponge I tried to smoothen all the parts and the edges of the cuts. In the next step I tried to create the edge of my design like uh, in the circular motion i use this method of circular motion and then i created or i started to make the glue using clay and some water uh, so our design sticks together and i made some hatches using uh, this tool and then i added i added the, uh, the clay glue and i put 
the edges on top. And I cut the axis using a cutter. And then you can start sticking it together and uh, collect it together using this tool. And then I, uh, I wrote my name and I added like a little heart and yeah. So here I'm letting it dry. It may take like 24 to 48 hours. And I have to clean this mess. So guys, this is the result after 24 hours. As I think it's still like wet inside. So I'm gonna let it dry for another 24 hours. So this is the result after 24 hours. So it's basically, it's the third day. Uh, here I started to sand the design, like the edges and all uh, some harsh, like hard, um texture and after the sanding process your design will look smoother when you paint and but make sure to uh, remove all the excess using a brush and it may take a lot of time like me here basically it took me like uh, almost 20 minutes to send all this design i don't know where you can find this sanding uh, paper but this one i use it to send my pen, send my pencils my graphite pencils so basically you may find it in the art stores And this is my favorite part, the uh, painting. Uh, I used black acrylic paint from uh, the brand Amsterdam, I think. Then when the bottom dried, I started to paint the, the top, the top of my design. And don't worry, the, the name that you wrote won't, uh, won't be removed. And then I got the idea of uh, adding some uh, gold paint, but not so much, just like a little brush stroke. Like I wanted that brush stroke effect. Here I used my uh, transparent uh, nail polish, it's mine, to just to add that glowy effect. Uh, yeah, and the design will look more uh, beautiful. And here I couldn't wait, wait for it to dry, so I stand like in the window just to dry it out faster. And yeah.
this is for today and this is our design for today hope you like today's video and uh, see you next time as you see you can use this for your accessories and your art supplies like for me i am using it for my art supplies like needed eraser and clubs etc Thank you.